Wait a sec. Did I just say something really important? What? I couldn't hear you. So they give you a second opportunity to change your mind or whatever. What am I thinking? Of course not. That would be too much of a coincidence. What are you mumbling about? I was just joking about coming along with so you. So you chose not to tell her, huh? That would change the future, wouldn't it? Probably. I'm really sorry, but... It's okay. I'm not going to say that I'm judging hey. you, but I'm going to be you silently judging you for the rest of this playthrough for choosing things. that. I will. So see you again soon. Though the, the way that the choice affects the rest of the game is kind of the opposite that you'd expect. Oh, Hugo. It's weird. Did you just get back? No, I heard everything. I heard everything. I didn't mean to be a snoop, but it didn't seem like I could just walk in. It's okay. I won't tell anyone. Oh, tell anyone I what? I didn't say anything. You could have just come in. I was just trying to be tactful. After all, sis. That's quite all right. Oh, um, Hugo. What? Are you still, you know, mother's lock of hair? What? I know how much you miss mother, but you can't carry that thing around forever. She's right. Forever. Sh shut up! <laughs> what do you mean, that thing? How could you say something like that? It's not as though I'm doing God. anything wrong. Fuck this stool. I hate his voice. <laughs> I'm sorry. That didn't I hate it. come out quite right. But you're the one who's being weird, changing the subject as soon as it gets a little thorny. Thorny. Hello. It's your fault. You ought to know that. How's it her fault? Did she you go. Father can't poison her mother start. or something? I know. <clears throat> I, uh, I, I should get going. Yes, uh, see you soon. I'm sorry it was so hectic around here. He's always like this. I just can't do a thing with him once he gets upset. So I just leave him alone when he's this way. Hmm. Hey, sis, are you sure you just want to let him go like this? Oh, stop that, Hugo. Well, uh, here. Will you take it? Consider I just pulled this comb out of my pants. For all the stories you told me. And something to remember today by. Good job, sis. Hugo, stop eavesdropping. Thank you, Margaret. See you. Okay. Peace. Our work here is not yet done. Because we have to... Show her this delicious chocolate. Nope, not the antidote. Chocolate. We got this from the baker earlier. What's this? Can I have it? Yes. It isn't much, but you just might like it. Her response Go is ahead. pretty Try funny. It. May I? This is so exciting. was wonderful. I've never tasted anything like it. What, chocolate? You liked it? Of course I did. I wish I could make something just like that. I could make a bunch <laughs> and eat them all. That sounds great. What do you think? Oh, this you might not is want to so eat them all though. Exciting. Thank you, Ike. I'm happy you liked it. Can I watch your figure. Would you like me to bring some more next time? You can bring them anytime you'd like. Uh, introduce the overly processed sweets. Just bring Cheetos next time. Anyways, back to the present. We now have the antidote. And we will survive our encounter with death. Oh. 
Now I'm gonna limp around like a zombie. Uh, hey, old lady! I'm drunk! Whoa! Alright. Finish him! I like that little uh, idle animation there. It's like someone's gonna perform a fatality on me. With one second left until I die, I'm gonna drink this and everything will be okay. Fast acting. <sighs> oh, guess I'm okay now. Comb?